What's the crack lads? Welcome back to the channel and we have got a brand new season upon us. It's called Ready for Action. As you can see there is season zero. So this is obviously going to be all about getting into eFootball 2024. We actually, they actually talk about it, right? So they say that season zero is now underway or is season O. The team for the season is ready for action. It sounds like an Arnold Schwarzenegger movie that's coming out soon. But anyway, the curtain raisers of the European domestic leagues are almost upon us. Let's get our dream team up and running as we anticipate the start of eFootball 2024. So it says that this would be introduced, these new seasons, alluding to the season's teams, a wide variety of player types would be introduced to create a more immersive footballing landscape, epic and highlight picks and packs. Um, and they also talk about standout performances of high achievers and real world fixtures as well. So, I mean, man of the match, player of the match, all of those type games, player of the month, all of those, right? They also talk about a new season, which is going to be a new event with ongoing events for the 650 million download campaigns. We'll get into that in this video. They also talk about new player lists such as Hollett, Saviola, Kaka are going to be getting the epics, Van Basten, Rivaldo, Inzaghi, other big names, chance deals, nominating contracts. We'll, we'll cover all of that, right? And then they've also updated the match pass. So there is a cheeky little video here as well, just to show you, right? Um... To be honest, I kind of like this style. I mean, you get the new season stuff. You've got Mount and Onana uh, with their player renders in. You've got Declan Rice at Arsenal. So the new season is finally kind of here, right? Where they're actually getting all this stuff in um, before they cross over to eFootball 2024 proper, right? So this is all the licensed teams, all their new transfers um, and their new kits. Everything is in and ready to go, um, you know, including a couple of, here, of players here, such as Gundo for Barca. Um, listen, man, I think, I think this is going to be something that takes a little bit of time to get going into eFootball 2024. We'll cover this in a second. It's the special login bonuses. You're going to be getting three epic players that you will be able to sign for free as login bonuses. Van Basten, the epic cards that are coming. A lot of people waiting for this one. Um, what a goal to recreate there as well. Hullet Van Basten as two legend epic cards or legends or whatever. I, I see a lot of contextual blocking there. I don't know how I feel about that. Um, but yeah, I mean, listen, these are going to be unbelievably like overpowered cards, right? We've also got a Japanese legend epic big time selection as well. They're not called legends, I suppose. They are, you know, epic players, so to speak. Um, but we've got a various pack here that is going to be quite interesting to have a look at as well. So um, Torres rounds us off with himself and David Villa and Forlan as the Japanese selection, right? So I think what they're kind of doing is they are going to be bringing a different variety of player. But it's going to be for players that have already been out there, but they're just going to be getting epic big times or else big, you know, epic cards. Now, I don't like that 360 no scope, as, as Seb would call it, uh, that 180 kind of flick um, finish from Clivert, but that looks nice. Um, I think that the gameplay needs the biggest upgrade. You know, that's going to be something we get into later on in the stream today. Um, but listen, all of that stuff there that we have here, we do have a brand new login bonus, which you're going to see right here, which is for the 650 million downloads campaign. We'll get into that in a second. 30,000 for the league, 3,000 eFootball points for the league as well, because the league has actually finished. And then they talk about upcoming events. So we'll cover all of this, lads. Look, we'll cover this as quickly and as best as we can. So this 650 million download campaign, you are going to be getting special login bonus just for logging in for throughout this campaign and for playing eFootball 2023. They have reached 650 million campaigns across, you know, every platform, right? Uh, the special login bonus is going to be three epics, 450,000 GP and 150 coins, okay? Then there is going to be campaign objectives, the same ones as you always are able to play, uh, where you get your 200 coins uh, for playing matches against other users online. You get 90,000 trainer points and 360,000 GP. And then the tour event, you're going to have two highlight players, a player of the week, um, and then you also get your trainers and your GP as well. And then it says earned coins based on the number of matches played. You can earn up to 300 coins. So they're really trying to get people to play now, I think. Um, it will depend on how much content that they do offer for that, right? So if we go into authentic here, we do have the USL championship match or the event still going on. That ends in 20 days. That's the normal. Um, but it is in here that we have a lot of new stuff. Well, it's not new stuff if you've been playing the game for a long time, but... You have the experience points here with the little uh, buy tree here. So you're going to be getting three times the experience points. It says accumulate 6,000 points and earn up to 100,000 GP, 20,000 XP um, and one chance deal, right? So this is your summer transfer 
Chan Steel, which we'll get to in a second, right? Um, then you also have this legend one, which is going to be against the English League. Introducing versus AI event of skill and prowess. Take on two different matches with your dream team. Clear all the challenges and your, get your hands on level training programs. So for this one here, it's the same as the rinse and repeat. I have a video up on how to dominate... Um, how to how to dominate the ai on legend difficulty for the second win so definitely check that out if you're struggling but there is some good stuff here to get as well uh you'll get twenty thousand gp for the first or xp for the first one for training programs and then you get your two skill trainers which are very valuable uh with the way the game is at the moment and you also have your unlimited that is for playing against that's just for your e-football coins okay so there is a lot of stuff in there as i said with this one as well um you do have uh, your 30,000, 30,000, then your summer transfer deal, and then your two trainer XPs at the end for the total prize at the end. So that free pass that you're going to get there, the eFootball League has also been reset, as you see here. Phase 13 has begun. So if you're in Division 1 like I was, you'll be back to Division 3. You'll get all your rewards. They'll be in your inbox, and you can start your phase again. Everything else is the same. Um, but then when we go into here, right, so I know people will ask me about the shop, and this shop has... Uh, has been lacking a couple of players. They don't have this updated yet, but I reckon that that will update when Hazard, Quadrado, and Shalabat, when they go, and then they'll probably bring in more players, probably Epics or Legends or whatever way you want to call it. There's nothing in strips there either. Um, so that is a bit of a bummer. I think they'll wait for eFootball 2024 proper to do that, right? There is a brand new match pass. These are the players in the match pass. You've got Thiago and you have uh, Shkamaka. The new players that have joined there. Well, Thiago is new. Um, but you also have your brand new match pass that will run until the 28th. So only a 25-day match pass. And that date is probably going to be a little bit more important than normal because we'll get into that in the live stream. Um, you've also got this 650 million downloads objectives. So you can get your coins there. Now, these will unlock as you unlock them. So when you score three goals here and you achieve these more uh, objectives will unlock as normal right and then last but not least i'm probably missing a couple of things just to go through the banner here um we do have the new players that we'll get into in a second including the summer transfers and um, the worldwide deluxe are still ongoing but yeah i think it's mostly the, the the packs here now right so first up i will be doing a review on all of these as normal you know where to go if you want it you've got van basten reichardt and hullet as your three netherlands epics i mean these players look absolutely insane even with the levels that they have 31 31 and 27 ridiculous i will get into them in a video shortly after this one you also have japanese epic players as well forlan via and uh, fernando torres and these are mixed in as well here with some other packs here um from other players all around so uh, listen this could be this could be an interesting pack as well especially forlan who's very overpowered in the game now they have the same design and the same kind of layout as they did last year for these summer transfers. So everyone remembers this Rudiger card that was absolutely insane. Um, these are not down as nominating contracts, right? These new players. So you've got Haberts, you've got Nakunku, you've got Aspilicueta. You've got all of these guys that have signed for their new clubs with new updated cards, okay, um, on these cards. But these are not nominating contracts. These are actually for coins and you only get three spins in them. You get your free spin which is one, and you get these three that you have to pay for with coins. So you do the event that we just talked about earlier. Um, and then also there is this one back in the game, ready for action. These are the nominating contracts. So you can see there at the top right-hand side of the screen, I've got two five stars and two four stars. These are the players on offer. Kempembe is going to be a machine. Um, I would also say that Ronaldo will be good, Hector Bellerin. And my man Corona, lads, we have to buy him. Absolute legend that he is. We are going to get Corona and see what he's like. But we'll test out all of these players. A bit of a disappointing selection based on first looking at them. But we'll get into them. You can get them for free with the nominating contract. And then the J League is there as well as the Worldwide Deluxe. And, of course... Um, the Columbia pack is still there, except that I've opened the Columbia pack. So, yeah, lads, that is pretty much it from me. They have updated a couple of other bits and pieces as well if you go in here to the main menu um, with the upcoming events. But just don't forget to get all your stuff in your inbox as well um, to get your free chance deal at the Netherlands and to be able to complete the events to get your free spin at the Player of the Week. And then, of course, we will have with this over the next course of three weeks when this campaign is ongoing in 20 days. For 20 days, you're going to have that special login bonus so an epic uh every 
week um, as it goes in for a total of three. So that is it for me, lads. Don't forget to subscribe. We will be back quite soon. Let me know who you want to see. I'm going to start with the Netherlands player review breakdown, and we will try open a few spins later on on the live stream. But until then, we'll talk to you in a bit. Don't forget to subscribe. Let me know if it's a hit or miss this today.